Issues surrounding vaping have become a concern for many families across our region. Now one county taking action to limit its exposure to children. WSAZ's Curtis Johnson looked at a new ordinance and spoke with those it impacts in Putnam County. Amy Connolly is the mother of a middle school daughter and she has significant concern with the number of vape shops in Putnam County. I live in a neighborhood that is right in the middle of, well, it's within a mile of three vape shops. Those stores located along West Virginia 34 and Kays Valley Road, this one in walking distance to an elementary school. Now a new county ordinance could block any additional vape shops from locating in the area. This month, the Putnam County Commission passing new limits on where stores can locate and restrictions on how they advertise. The new ordinance says no new vape shop can open within a mile of another vape shop or within the same distance to a school, church, bar, or residence, among other limits. Dustin Bogus, himself a vape shop owner, says given the number of vape shops currently in business and not subject to the ordinance, he is tentatively okay but worries about the long-term impact as stores close. If it weren't for existing business or if something were to change, then I, again, I don't know of any retail space in this area that would be accommodating or able to uh, suit that kind of business. The ordinance also takes aim at signage. These signs are legal and grandfathered in, given they are at existing businesses. But flashing signs and those with images of marijuana prohibited at any new vape shop. Commissioner Andy Skidmore says the entire ordinance has one focus. We've seen such an impact on our youth that we felt like we had to intervene in some way. And so this is our way of trying to help out, try to curb uh, the usage of vaping amongst our young people. Conley agrees and worked with many others to support passage of the ordinance. Do we have the population in Putnam County that we need vape shops within a mile of each other? Um, do we need them in residential areas where youth can get from the bus stop to the vape shop in one block. The ordinance only applies to areas outside of city limits in Putnam County. Although the commissioner hopes cities will take similar action. He said it's already being looked at in a hurricane. Reporting in Putnam County, Curtis Johnson, WSAZ. So the other shops in Curtis's story declined comment. Commissioner Skidmore says they patterned the ordinance after similar discussions in another county in central West Virginia. He believes Putnam County's ordinance is a first for a county in our area of the state. Again, the new ordinance only affects new businesses, so you won't see any changes to existing vape stores.